I really think that Ice Spice's debut album will flop. Seriously. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're diving into a topic that's been on my mind for a while. Will Ice Spice's debut album flop? Before we get into it, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Listen, I know I haven't uploaded in a short while. I had flu and now I'm okay. And this annoying voice is back on the internet again. Now, let's talk about Ice Spice. I want to start by saying that this video isn't about tearing her down, saying that she's overhyped, she's untalented. No, 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 no. Personally, I really like it. Remember her hit single? You thought I was killing you? No. It's catchy, it's fun, and it definitely put her on the map, but there's a real concern here, especially after hearing her recent single, Give Me a Light. Is this a sign that her upcoming album might not live up to the hype? Let me know in the comments. First off, let's address the elephant in the room. Ice Spice became a sensation not just because of her music, but also, I think more importantly, because of her looks, her image, her brand. She's a light-skinned girl with ginger red curly locks, and she's got measurements, if you know what I mean. The industry, and honestly, the audience, saw her and was like, yes, that's her. It's unfortunate, but we can't ignore how much looks play into an artist's initial success these days, especially when you are a female artist. But let's talk music. One of the main issues with Ice Spice's songs is that they tend to be repetitive. Take Give Me a Light, for example. It's not a bad song, but it suffers from the same problem with many of her songs do. They follow the same flow, rhyme schemes, lines like, you think it is shit, bitch, you ain't even a fuck. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I actually like that line. I don't know what it is, but I, I understand it. But while well, everyone else is just complaining that why the hell is she talking about poop bars? But anyway, I digress. Um, But when you hear similar punchlines over and over, it starts to get old fast. It's like she's rearranging the same punchlines and poop jokes in different ways. That's not enough to sustain a long term interest. Not to mention, her numbers are starting to drop. Her monthly listeners are falling. She's struggling to be on the Billboard 100 and that really sucks. Like, this is, this might be a sign for a change. Her music and marketing tactics need to change. If Ice Spice wants to be taken serious as an artist, she needs to grow and be versatile. Two years into her career, she still sounds like she just came out. There's nothing inherently wrong with being a meme artist or a hit maker, but if she wants longevity and critical acclaim, she's got to evolve. She doesn't have that choice. One way she could do this is by working with songwriters. Yes, she writes most of her songs, and you can definitely tell. While there's value in authenticity and self-expression, collaboration with experienced songwriters could bring fresh perspectives and new ideas to her music. She needs inspiration and a broader range of content in her lyrics. Another area for improvement is her performance skills. Ice Spice is yet to do her own full-scale concert. Twerking to get the crowd's attention only works for so long, but it's getting old pretty fast. To hold her audience, she needs to develop a more engaging stage presence and performance routine. Connecting with the audience through her music and performance is crucial. This is what happens when record labels just sign influencers, just sign someone that just started making music a year ago. They skip the most crucial part, which is artist development. This is what happens. But at least there's room for improvement. I mean, look at Dua Lipa. Dua Lipa did not know how to perform, like seriously. But now she's better than ever thanks to critics like me that like dude like you are a product artists need to remember that you are a customer service business people have the right to tell you that look this is just not it like come on like you know what i'm off topic ultimately the success for her debut album, Y2K, will depend on whether she can break out of her current mold and show some growth. 
If the album is just more of the same, it's likely to fall flat. But if she can bring something new to the table, who knows? She might just surprise us all. So question of the day, do you think I Spice's debut album, Y2K, will do well? Let me know in the comments below. I'm really curious to hear what y'all think, but don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Let's conversate and debate, and just like that, we out.